great news now. We've got a two-rider team this weekend. Hopefully to pro progress forward to the end of the season with the two-rider team. And uh, obviously we've got young Jake Dixon come in who's joined our rider this year, Alice Cecily. So going forward, we're expecting some really, really good results from, from Jake towards the end of the year. Strong performing here at Knock Hill already this, this, this weekend. Uh, across the, uh, the warm-up and qualifying, it's done very well. It's taken to it really well. There's no pressure on Jake, obviously, joining the team. There's no pressure on results. It's just basically a learning year for Jake. We wanted to put something together. He approached us. There was an opportunity. We wanted to give him the opportunity. And we want to see what he can do, obviously, on a superbike for himself. It's nice for, for the sponsors. So it's good to go to a two-man team, and it's where we want to progress to for 2017. As people know, I split from MV. Um, I just didn't feel like the, the bike was competitive enough to, to go forward and win weight races. So... Um, I, I left the team and then luckily me and Lee started speaking and uh, uh, things came about and he said, well, let me see what I can do and I'll come back to you. And he said, right, I've, I can give you a, a bike and a test. And I said, OK, well, we'll go forward from there. And then he said, if you do well at the test, we will uh, we'll go forward to continue into Knock Hill. So as you can see that we're here, we're here now and uh, we're hopefully we're here for the rest of the season. So. It's fast, don't get me wrong, it, the Superbike is very, very fast and uh, yeah, but no, so much fun. The team are mega, they're working fantastic and uh, I've got a fantastic feel at the minute and hopefully we can just keep making step by step and keep going forward and that's the plan. Two finishes, two finishes. <laughs>
it's, there's Jake, Jake Dixon. Dixon. Brilliant ride from him. His debut, brave, brave light, right. debut in British Superbikes. He was running strongly and, and entering the top ten when he was fetched off by his mentor and manager in the first race. And here he is running in... Uh, 13th place, ahead I mean, of Stuart Easton and Lee Jackson. I went looking for him and didn't get to speak to him, but it must be so. I mean, that was a big hit he took from Wainwright. I mean, not Wainwright's fault, but it was a huge hit. Shaky Bird takes his 11th race win of this, his career here at Knockhill, and poor Linfoot loses the drag up to the line. Uh, Javier Beltran shrugs his shoulders.